In the movie, Clive Owen ends up delivering this baby in the middle of a gunfight, and he ends up being stuck with it. Oh. He's the most hard-boiled guy in the world with the most innocent thing in the world. And he's this damaged guy. His life has gone wrong. But he goes to Monica Bellucci, they hook up and kind of become this makeshift family. And in amongst all this bloodshed and crazy violence, the family unit heals him. I miss that. There's this beautiful, crazy love story between Mr. Smith and the Q. And when the film starts, neither one of them know how to love or what love means. And through this baby that accidentally comes into their lives, a baby that they have to protect and take care of, they realize who they truly are. And through giving to the baby, they also learn how to love each other. For all I know, you snatched the kid. I don't want to be an accessory for kidnapping. I didn't steal the kid, trust me. Trust you. I don't even know your real name. Who are you, really, Smith? I'm a British nanny. And I'm dangerous. It's a classic character, really, because he's in the middle of this action film. You don't get to know too much about him, but all you need to know, really, is that he's pretty deadly with his gun and he's going to protect his baby and come through these huge action sequences that are hopefully unscathed. <laughs> You know, my character, Mr. Smith, is a very sort of dry, you know, you know, one line, very contained. And, and Paul's character is this sort of wild, crazy man. And Paul was having the time of his life, and he's such a great actor. It was like a, you know, it was perfect for, you know, to play opposite him. Tell me where the woman and child are, or I will be forced to cause you considerable agony. Nothing could be more painful than listening to you jabbering on and on. He's great, you know, I mean, it's nice with a guy like this who's such a good actor, and, but he's having a good time, and he's just a sweet man, and he knows exactly what he's doing, and he's really good at this kind of thing, which there's not many guys who are good at this kind of thing anymore. You know, and he can do that kind of tough guy, vulnerable tough guy thing fantastically, so he's just a nice man to be around, too. <laughs> God, do we really suck? Or is this guy really that good?